Pandemic preparedness has been a topic of discussion since the outbreak of COVID-19 in 2019. Judy Shire has more of the discussions. The annual BRICS summit was one of many global events disrupted by the COVID-19 pandemic, which claimed over 6.9 million lives. Now that it's returned, the ability of countries to handle public health emergencies is on the agenda. We need to strengthen our preparedness to be able to respond to public health emergencies. Because when they happen, they disrupt. And when they dis the public health emergencies disrupt our effort towards universal health coverage, they, blow us, they bring us backward. The pandemic brought into question the state of global systems and raised concerns about health care equity, especially for Africa. We cannot be in a situation again where Africa faces a next pandemic or a pre-pandemic or a regional epidemic, whatever the case is, and we are not able to treat and or vaccinate our people. We need the global institutions that are procuring medicines and vaccines to start procuring from Africa for Africa. It's a moral responsibility of our states, heads of states, to talk about this matter and raise it firstly and consolidate it within themselves as BRICS heads of state, but also take that agenda item into the Nigerian General Assembly. Because there are certain countries who are not yet in BRICS, but also were left behind when the, when the previous pandemic hit us. The World Health Organization estimates an additional $10.5 billion is needed every year to strengthen emergency responses. If you look at the funding that is required, not just in countries, it's at country level, regional level, and globally. So it's like a global requirement. But I believe if there's a will to do that, the global community is, will be able to identify those funding to put into that. Because, you know, if you cannot assure health, you cannot assure development and well-being. BRICS leaders are being called upon to act decisively to prevent a repeat of the COVID-19 pandemic. The World Health Organization has called for efforts to be doubled, with most countries not prepared to handle another pandemic. Judy Shara, CHTN, Johannesburg, South Africa.